Hey, what is up guys? Guitar Rock here. Welcome back to another Counterside video. Alright, today's video we're going to talk a little bit about Awaken Ju Xiyun. So, I have been testing him for the last couple of days, alright, ever since I pulled him. PT by the way, so it's not, uh, not a fun process to be able to PT him. And of course, uh, this is much more of a PvP take. Uh, again, this is just mostly my point of view after testing him for several days, I think about 3 to 4 days now. I feel like he's not as good as I anticipated him to be, alright? That's not saying that he's the worst uh, unit out there. I feel like there's still ways to make him work, it's just uh, it's just a tough one. Alright, so and this again, what I'm saying is just based on my experience in using him and based on my gears, alright? So I know different people might have a different varying experience, but I feel like from a PvP spend point of view, like it, here's the thing, right? Straightforward. If you are a new player, avoid pulling for him at all costs because I don't think he's going to help your account in any ways or shape or form, right? I feel like there's a lot of other characters that can help your account in a much better way either from an Awakened standpoint of view or either from a Striker form of view. For example, Ria Mesorosa. I just think it's a much better Striker than Awakened Ju Shiyun is. Now again, this is for someone who has limited resources. Now if you are someone who has been playing for a while, you have plenty of uh, resources pulling for Awakened Ju Shiyun, I don't think it's the end of the world, right? So yeah, so let's show you guys a little bit of the battles and then hopefully at the end of the video, you guys can see my concluding thoughts uh, talking about Awakened Ju Shiyun. So I managed to do a bunch of testing with him uh, from day one, day two, day three onwards uh, with like one versus one, uh, PvP, ETC, just the collective battles that we have tested out and you guys can see for yourself uh, in the matches. Alright, let's jump into it. Okay, let's do this an experiment, alright? Yuna, Jushiyun. Can, can he counter and kill my Phoenix? I think he can, right? What if he counter and kill my Phoenix? Look, my Phoenix really die. Oh, it doesn't counter and kill Phoenix, maybe? How come there's an egg? I'm a bit confused. Okay. Yo, he won! Oh, he didn't. Okay, that was a little bit confusing. His counter doesn't hit air. Wait, which is the one that hits air now? It's the ultimate skill or something, right? That is Shiyun versus Asterosa. Ah? Ah? Who? Who is winning? A heal is winning. Then he got Anastasia Chernova abuser. Alright, I got a Shiyun as well. Here come the true AJSY team. Look, his Shiyun still die! Paper! Still die, paper! What now, paper? Where's your Shiyun? No Shiyun, right? Food Panda, though. Food Panda? Where's your Food Panda? He even got Lucretia buff, right? Lolly. Oh my god! He's back insane! Insane! Oh my god! Ultimate skill! Oh my god! This is insane! My ultimate skill as well? Oh my god! Paper shit! It's fair, right? Both of us have New Detroit. So Amina and Ju A. Jushin, we just try. Alright, so here, here. I went in, he's gonna counter me, is it? Okay, he counters me. Okay. Okay. So we both got perfect evasion, right? Dang, that's a lot of damage. Insane. Insane damage. That was... CDR abuser, Paul? Yeah, the issue that I see is... I feel like his role is similar to Asterosa. He's supposed to be in the front line and tank and hopefully applies counter as well. But he just doesn't tank as well as Astorosa, sort of. So it's like... Is there a... Is there a reason to use him over Astorosa? 
unless Asterosa is banned. Which I think will happen eventually for sure. And he's also like 6 cost. 6 cost best A Jushin, alright? Akisa, best A Jushin, alright? If you guys having doubts, look at this. Akisa's A Jushin is here. Okay, with Arius as well, Akisa is smart. He's doing this insane with Arius as well. Okay, with Lily as well. Okay, okay, Akisa's Lily. Akisa is the smartest player. If Akisa can't make this work, I don't think anyone can. Alright, look at Akisa. He's struggling to make A Jushiyun work. His paper ship, do 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 paper ship. So I, I, you know, like, here's my opinion, right? I feel like if Akisa can't make this work, I think Jushiyun is just a very hard character to use. I honestly think so. I honestly think so. Considering that Akisa has been playing 6 billion matches in this game, try A Jushiyun with 4 support. 4 supports! Why not go A heal there then? Why, why A Jushiyun? Alright, Nayubin versus Jushiyun 1 on 1. JSY in 1 on 1 is kinda unfair. But I'm Nayubin abuser though. I don't think... I don't think he destroys A heal there though, does he? I bet A Jushiyun win anyways. Okay, how about A heal there then? If A heal there, I have no way to test. Ah. It will take 10 years, of course. Sheep buff cringe. <laughs> Alright, fair enough, he does have sheep buff, while I don't. Insane, insane. Does this counter? Now you has the most useless ultimate skill ever. His special counters A heal day. I can go to the toilet and it won't end yet. I mean it's ending, it's ending. So who can one on one him? That is not Kim Chul So. Ajo Shion wins anybody. Not Asterosa though, right? We already established that, right? Ajo Shion versus Veronica. What do you guys think? Who is better, huh? Any Veronica haters? A Yumina versus A Jushiyun. We just did that just now. We just did that. Bzzup. Okay, counter. Okay. Okay. I'm not gonna do much damage until later. Okay, now I do a lot of damage. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. I guess he is tank tanky enough to survive all of this. I'm still alive, insane. Can he actually lose? Does he actually lose to Asarosa? Now that I think of it. What's with the hate on gears, guys? What's with the hate on gears? Who's faster at backdooring, huh? One on one? Dang. One on one backdoor? Amy now wins at backdoor? Insane. Amy now wins. I think Asterosa loses. Veronica bet didn't even is not even close, right? Why would why would Asterosa wins rearm? But let's see, right? I see a lot of miss. No, my paper sheep. My paper. Oh, Asterosa is so tanky. What the heck? She is so tanky, and my paper sheep is getting destroyed. All right, this this is much more interesting actually. So Asterosa Rearm is still better! Look at her! Zoom! Oh my god, the barrier? Didn't even come out? Dang, who would win guys? This intense! Place your bets! Place your bets! Who would win? Dang! Okay, it is a level 103 though. Anyone has 110 Jushiyun? We try with 110 Jushiyun, alright? Anyone? Boom! Okay, not gonna hit my paper ship. So the range is about here. Okay, this is 110. Akisa's CDR as well. Wait, is Akisa using CDR or what? Uh, Joshiun is doing about 3 to 400 damage. Asterosa is doing 1000 plus. Yeah, I feel like Asterosa is... Maybe... Here's the thing, right? The meta... Correct me if I'm wrong. In KR, who came first? 
Joshi Yun, Awaken Joshi Yun came first or Astrosa came first? I think it's uh Joshi Yun came first, right? Yeah, I feel like the meta in C server Meta in C server is so screwed because the order of everything is so jumbled up. So it's like, is there a point to pull for this character when there's a better one that came out? Asterosa came out way later, I think, right? It's not really who is better here, but it, it, it it's the same unit from KR, it's just that they, they turn it around. They shuffle, they shuffle it around, which is so, sort of crazy. It just makes a unit way stronger. True damage is too much. Eijo Shion came last September, Asterosa came in January. So what I'm saying is, um, because C server changes the order of everything as compared to KR server, so a lot of units that, that is strong, like Jushun is kind of strong when he first came out in KR, now it's like, because C has so much stronger characters like Asterosa Rearm already, so it's like, it makes Jushun a little bit underwhelming, I guess, in a way. Gitara wanna say, hey Jushun suck ass? No, no, he's good, man, he's the best Queen Ti dude. You know, a bit underwhelming, I guess, because Asterosa came last week, and I'm like using, I'm, I'm like an Asterosa abuser, you guys are Asterosa abuser. And then we are all Asterosa abuser. And then this week, Jushiyun came, so what? Asterosa is already better, you know? I don't wanna see you. I don't wanna hear you tonight. I don't wanna fight you. You don't wanna know if I feel right. I don't wanna just forgive you, I just wanna be fine. I'll be waiting for a sign to light up, yeah. 